Forest fires cause enormous ecological damage and destroy hundreds of thousands of hectares every year. To fight this plague, man must use all his resources and study the very best and most efficient means. The southwest of France is the biggest forest mass in Europe. The Lond forest covers more than 500,000 hectares and consists mainly of coniferous trees. In 1999, the Lond Fire Brigade began a large-scale study based on real fires. It aimed to optimize firefighting by using Biofor, the wetting and foaming agent developed by the BioX company. Biofor was selected by the fire brigade for its specific qualities. Its wetting effect at very low concentrations of use, its exceptional foaming properties, its perfect eco-friendly profile since it allows immediate seeding after application without harming the flora or fauna. The study consisted in burning rectangular two hectare areas of 10-year-old maritime pines 12 meters high. The trial compared the efficacy of an attack with water alone to that with water plus Biofor, the wetting agent. Biofor is applied at a dose of 2 per thousand with a Quadrifog 150 nozzle at 100 liters per minute. The most recent proportioning systems provide the accuracy and reliability required. The forest is set alight. The fire picks up speed with the wind. The attack is mounted diagonally by following the fire's progression. The technique consists in attacking the fire from the vantage point of the vehicle. This method, which has always been used in the land, is the most efficient for this type of vegetation. The relatively flat terrain makes this approach possible. The firemen notice that a critical application rate is sufficient to stop the fire. A second application in support ensures complete extinction. Unlike a water-only application, there is no smoke nor reignition on the ground treated with biofuel. To ensure total safety, a foam layer is applied around the burned area. This is done by attaching a foam adapter to the quadrifog nozzle. So, without changing concentration, it's possible to obtain the wetting or foaming effect as required. Another test aims to evaluate the possibility of controlling a fire using a fire break made with biofor used as a foam barrier. Biofor is used at 5 per thousand at medium expansion with a Quadrifog 150 nozzle equipped with its medium expansion adapter at 100 liters per minute. First, a 2 meter wide foam fire break is laid down and then a second identical one, six meters from the first one. The second one is a precautionary measure just in case the fire jumps the first barrier. As in the previous trial, the forest is set alight. The fire, kindled by the wind, rapidly gains in volume, reaching a height of 15 meters, the smoke becoming thicker and thicker. On reaching the Biofor fire break, the fire loses strength and changes direction 90 degrees to the right. It gathers strength again, but then finally peters out. A few wisps of fire have in fact crossed the first barrier and have stopped at the second one. However, in an emergency situation, these could easily be controlled by one vehicle and they present no danger. After extinction, the two foam barriers are fully intact. The fire was unable to destroy the foam and even less to cross it. One day later, the foam is no longer visible and the vegetation is totally preserved. Biofor is the ultimate answer to forest fires. This study demonstrates Biofor's all-round capabilities, both as a wetting agent when attacking a fire and as a protective firebreak. The Land Fire Brigade has opened up new paths for forest firefighting based on the best possible combination of wetting and foaming agents. These techniques could now be used in new strategies such as the protection of inhabited areas. Biofor is the right product for the job 
thanks to its peak efficacy at very low concentrations, such as 1 to 5 per thousand.